At Yosemite, Dad suggests writing a race poem and replacing his name with Baba. The mirror lakes of Frisbee, or an oriental court fan, the slate crags chambers for dragon orchestras. The dogs with their heads in the ice aren't dogs anymore, only metaphors in service of hurt. When a kingbird alights beside a grinning baby, I write its wingspan as a strike of yellow blood. Dad hums this through the winter, good, very good, but alter good to Hun Hall. In the white water, there's zero flotsam. I still dredge up my birth certificate. Because it's profitable to liken English lettering to a bloated lifeboat, that or a slow rotting tongue. I'm 16 and understand that ethnic drift is the rage, that ethnic rage is the rage, since nowadays every Chinese girl's got a sonic crown about dumplings. <laughs> Here, I mentioned that my wasted Mandarin name means poet, minutia I can contrive to a symbol. Well, Dad remarks, there's something to be written about dead heritage and assimilation. And although I'm not angry, I can always artifice the feeling. Look, when the sun slumps its rays against the poplars just right, even they become part of this race poem. And yet it's weeks until spring. Forgive me, I do love federal heartland. And forgive me, when a kingbird alights beside a grinning baby, I only want to think of the wetted arc of its feathers, the wind blustering over acres, nothing more. Thank you.